Now, former President Olusha Gombasan just says Nigeria needs more rebels who would speak truth to power, not minding whose ox is good. Obasan just said that he's in Abelkota while unveiling the autobiography of the Babala Adini of Egbaland, Chief Tayo Shomi. It's titled Footprint of a Rebel. It was part of the 80th birthday celebration of the former activist and elder statesman. However, uh, the serving overseer of the Citadel Global Community Church, Pastor Tony Bakare, called for intergenerational reintegration between older and younger generations as part of efforts to rebuild Nigeria. Those who will look at things straight in the face and say, this is not right. This is not on. This I will not be part of. This is not good for Nigeria. Kidnappers, drug pushers, drug users, users, corrupt politicians, and treasury looters in the public and private sectors are products of families. Dysfunctional homes produce dysfunctional nations, but strong families are the units of a strong nation. The transference of a worthy legacy from value-driven parents to their offspring will result in value-driven societies. Second, we must embrace the redemptive value of culture. We must revive those aspects of culture that foster community spirit and nation building. Mindful of the African proverb that says, it takes a village to raise a child. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.